And authorities are searching for suspects after a deadly armed robbery at a luxury high rise in downtown Los Angeles. And this is the second homicide at the building in nearly two years. KTLA 5's Kimberly Chang is live in downtown LA with the latest developments. Kimberly. Glenn Liu, we're now learning that the person killed was 20 years old and there was some type of argument that took place before the shooting happened at this luxury apartment community here in downtown LA. It's the second time that there's been what I understand to be a homicide in the building. In the past couple of years, there's been two separate homicides at the Thea at Metropolis in downtown Los Angeles. Monday, police responded to a robbery call at the luxury high rise on 8th Street around 4.30 p.m. Police say three men armed with guns entered an apartment and demanded property from a resident, then shot the victim. Police say that person died at the hospital. We spoke with neighbors earlier. I first noticed because people were sending me message saying there are a lot of police cars downstairs and we wasn't sure what's going on. And I think they tried to ask the police and the police didn't give any response. LAPD say two suspects took off on foot and one in a vehicle. Police didn't give details about how the suspects got into the building or what they may have stolen in the robbery. Our building is secure. No one can get to our unit unless you want them to come to your unit. The Thea at Metropolis is a luxury apartment community. Residents can pay anywhere from $2,500 to about $20,000 to rent here. Residents say they have security guards around the building. It's gated and people need a key fob to get access upstairs. I mean, this is LA, you know, this is LA, it's an expensive building. Um, when you think about the type of people who can afford to live here, there's a couple types, you know, there's the people who are, you know, kind of, and a small percentage of elite, high-working individuals, and there's other people who are elite hustlers. Back in January 2023, a man was also shot to death in the same building. Police said there was a shootout inside a unit. I definitely feel not safe, but then in the meantime, I feel like it's not only SIA, it's also other buildings in downtown has this type of cases. And um, I wish it can be better, but like living here is just it's kind of things it this type of things is something we are dealing with every day. I feel safe here. Yeah, I never the only thing that would make me feel unsafe is I mean obviously things that no one can control. If someone starts shooting in a building and something a bullet goes through the wall and yeah, that's 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 heart disheartening, it's scary. It's a very safe building. They you know, management is really good to us, but like she said, it's just certain type of people that are in the building. At last check, police are still searching for three suspects. One of them is believed to be between 20 and 25 years old. No vehicle description available. Uh, we have reached out to the building management for comment, but didn't hear back before airtime. Reporting in downtown LA, Kimberly Chang, KTLA 5 News.